Welcome to the Real Estate Webcast on Unconditional, um, brought to you by realestate.co.nz. This is our opportunity to share inside information on the property market, and this is an opportunity once a month to go through our regular New Zealand property report. This provides an insight to the market as seen from the activity of new listings coming on the market. And this covers uh, the month of August. And really the picture is one where we're seeing a continuing high level of inventory on the market. 46.1 weeks of stock of property is sitting on the market. It is not receding much because sales are not as active as been in the past couple of years. Certainly the July figures at just over 4,400 sales was a low figure um, by any measure over the last 20 years. Now in the month of August, there was a steady flow of new listings, just under 10,000. That's uh, seasonally a little bit lower than expected. So we're seeing a slight slowdown in new listings coming on the market, a steady and fairly large amount of inventory on the market, which is definitely indicating that the buyers still have the upper hand in the market. The interesting third indicator we look at on the report is the asking price expectation. And that's taken from all the listings that come onto the website. And that one at $403,000, a little bit up on July, not by a huge amount, but that in itself was interesting because we had seen a, a degree of a fall back between June and July going into winter, which might have indicated that sellers were cautiously pricing at the market but clearly as it's coming into spring as we're approaching that spring period, there's a degree of confidence among sellers. So we've got a market that is definitely quiet, um, steady flow of new listings. It's going to be important that the sellers looking to take advantage of the market in the spring need to price appropriately, need to market actively, and need to be very conscious of what is on the market that they're competing with to ensure they find the buyers because as yet we haven't seen a mass of new buyers appear in the market. So it is going to be an interesting couple of months. Uh, September, October, November are three most important months of the year. The spring surge of activity, both in terms of people looking uh, to list and people looking to buy. So uh, the full report is available on the website, the NZ Property Report on realestate.co.nz. So it's available to provide insight on a regional basis. But that gives you the headlines for this month's report.